Hi, it's Lynn Dye. Today we're going to look at how to set up your PC to accept the send to command where if you want to send a book or whatever to your Kindle or send something to Dropbox or to OneDrive, we're going to look at that. And I had just gotten a new PC, so I want to reset up my send to Kindle for PC command. You can go to just, you can do a search on it and then from within Amazon and you'll come here to set it up. So I'm going to click that to download it and I'm going to save the file where I'm going to save it to my downloads and you can also click up here in your right and it'll show where it is so I'm going to install this I'll put this on pause while I get it installed that did take a minute so I'm going to click finish it's finished here and then I'm going to sign into my Amazon account and that did register my computer with Amazon and it says I can start sending things these are the different ways. So I'm going to close that out. And now let's look at uh, my file explorer, Windows Explorer, and see how that is going to work. Um, now if I want to send something to my Kindle, all I need to do is right click on it and the Kindle should show up. So let me just see if I can find a picture here where I'm right clicking on it and I'm saying send to Kindle. So then it'll show up. Here's uh, this image and I just want it to go to my Kindle I don't want it to go to my phone and click send and it's uploading it to my Kindle and then I'll be able to look at it there now that you know how to get things on your Kindle let's look at how to send things to different places where, you, where we don't have a download from Amazon I want to send some things maybe to Dropbox or to OneDrive and the way you get started, you look at this graphic here and you'll need to navigate to your send to folder. And this is here after your name, app data, roaming, Microsoft, Windows, and then there's a send to folder. And these were already set up. And now that we've got our Kindle figured out, what if we want to send a document to Dropbox or OneDrive? Let's Let's uh, figure that out. So come over here to your Dropbox icon and then simply drag it over here and it says create a link. That's what we want to do. And I want to do one for my OneDrive. So I'm going to drag that over there. So now if I want to send something to either of these places, I'll have more choices. And you can do this with other, other places. If you know, you can drag your music or your pictures, whatever, over there and it just makes it a lot easier to do. Please consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks so much for watching.